Good day, today is our lesson is unit one, subunit one, are you happy? Our grammar material question forms will cover your free time and how to ask and answer personal questions. Before reading our grammar, let's have a look to our vocabulary, free time. Exercise number 1a and as you can see here, we have five words and five phrases. We have to complete phrases one to five below with the verbs in the box. Go, eat, have, play, spend. The first one is an example. For us, go shopping, go on holiday. The second one, time with family, money. Let's have a look. We can spend time with our family. We can spend money. The third one, out with friends. We can eat out, we can eat with our friends. Time off, have a barbecue. Uh, we ha can have time off, we can have a barbecue. A sport, musical instrument, and the last one is play. Play a sport, play a musical instrument. Okay, then let's continue with our speaking. Uh, exercise number 5a, read the questions, think about your answers. Uh, this is question about our unit, and these questions are about our unit. What small things in life make you happy? What made you smile today? Why do you feel happiest? What things in your house make you happy? Are you happy right now? Why or why not? When did you last laugh a lot? Where were you? You can answer to these questions on your own with your own opinions. And now uh, let's have a look to our grammar material question forms. Okay, grammar material question forms. Yes, no questions are questions that only require a yes or no answer. For questions in the present and past simple, put the auxiliary do, does, did before the subject. For example, does he live here? Yes, he does. For questions B, put B before the subject. Is he married? No, he isn't. Questions with question words, which ask more Que uh, <coughs> this kind of questions ask for more than a yes or no answer. Use the same word other as yes, no question. Let's have a look. Question words. Where, when, why. Where does he live? When do you see your parents? Why did they phone me? Question words. Why and what? Why are you sad? What is he doing? Okay, let's have a look. Uh, to these question words. Use who for people. Use where for places. Use what or which for things. But we have a written note for what and which, which has a limited number of possible answers. Which do you want? The red or blue jumper? What has a large number of possible answers? What music do you like? Okay, let's remember it. And Use when for time, use how often for frequency, use how long for length of time, distance, use how much, how many for quantity, use why for reasons, use wh what time for a time, of course. Okay, let's have our practice exercise about, about our grammar material. It's exercise number 7a and put the word in the correct order to make questions. Of course, for making questions, we must start with our question word. The first one, money or your how in people family. Our question word is how. How many people are in your family? The second one, see often you parents how you do. Our question word, how often do you see your parents? The third one, family ways you spending do your time enjoy. Do you enjoy spending time with your family? The fourth one, last year when celebration was family. When was your last family celebration? The fifth one, you do live, you do with live who? Who do you live with? Six, you often eat two friends how out with. How often do you eat out with your friends? And the last one, friend your wife leave where best does. Our question word, of course, where does your best friend leave? Okay, now we have speaking material. We have photos and we have questions here about hobbies, interests, about holidays, about weekend. 
you can answer to this question on your own with your own opinions about your hobbies about your interests about your holidays and about your weekend um, i can do the first one as an example for example what do free time what do you do on your free time about holidays where you usually go holiday where do you go or do you usually go for holiday and on your weekend uh, what do you like do on your weekend for example and you can answer to all these questions with your own opinions thank you very much thank you for your attention